Okay, wow! It's just the first day, and we still have two days to go. So the latest technology and innovation that's happening. The FTCC and management thought that we should also have a full-fledged uh, startup and incubation committee. Welcome, viewers, to My Startup TV. We are at the first edition of Industrial Innovation and Technology. Expo 2023 which is organized by uh, FTCCI in Hyderabad uh, and going by what we've seen so far we witnessed it's been one of the you know well organized uh, events and I have with me uh, Kathleen Arane who's the CEO of uh, FTCCI welcome ma'am welcome to this thank you so first thoughts first reaction first event under your leadership how do you say Okay, wow. It's just the first day and we still have two days to go. So I think the next two days we want to ensure that we have a lot of visitors, a lot of MSMEs who can, you know, participate, interact with the, you know, stall owners. So uh, it's, it's just the beginning. So there's no reaction as of now, but I've asked my team to continue pushing and bringing in as many members as possible. And it's been a three months work, isn't it? And short time, but within that short time, it's definitely a very short time because if you look at the FTCCI for one presidential year, we organize around one ten to one twenty events in a year, and this is the first time that we've got into an exhibition sector. And definitely, FTCCI is not a commercial organization like uh, any other exhibition organizer. So we just are very neutral not for profit organization however we have to organize everything on a very sustainable way and uh, uh, end of the day the objective is the same to empower msmes for connection to uh, bring to them the latest technology and innovation that's happening and the objective was very simple definitely we only had three months to work on it and i think team has done fairly well and we could have 130 um, exhibitors and a lot of visitors, as you may see. But the biggest challenge is uh, the feedback, you know, because I think we should be much more open to taking their feedback and what is it and what was lacking and how how can we perform, how can we evolve as a better chamber, you know, because end of the day, it's all for them. So, you know, if we just uh, give them an open ear, I think we'll be able to perform better. You also had a, a very good lineup of partners, you know, uh, com coming from different uh, segments. You had somebody from the Passport, somebody from T-Hub, uh, you know, and they, they play a key role in, in FTCCI and the partnership. Yeah, they do because uh, I think it's the state government has, government of Telangana has been very, very supportive towards the federation and they really encourage all the activities that we organize. Usually we go to the industries department, you say Mr. Jayesh Ranjan or Dr. Vishnu Reddy, they've all been very, very supportive to the Federation. In fact, before even we start working on any project, we go to them, seek their support, you know, because th that's the time when we really think that they'll be able to guide us well. Sometimes when we curate things, we just completely forget, forget about what is it that we need to cater to, you know. So that's how we get connected to the actual industry and then come back so uh, even from the government or the industry or the startup community or the enterprises the feedback is very important one that is after the event and one even before we start curating the event what are the real-time issues the challenges and what is it that we should do so i think these are two learning lessons that we we've, we've been taught and you know we're trying to stick to that so and uh and now, as my startup TV, we are the you know uh, world's first TV channel dedicated to startups. And I need to ask this question: uh, There is a big push within FTCCI for startups. Also, could you talk about that? Yeah. So um, this this was like um, probably I would say last year in July was the time. June July is when you know the FTCCI management thought that we should also have a full fledged uh, startup and incubation committee. And that's where we have the chair, the co-chair of the committee. And of course, they have been tying up and signing MOUs with not just T-Hub, but series of, I think, uh, other organizations. The whole exercise is, you know, we know, everyone knows that there are uh, a specific organization whether it's state government or uh, private entity. But then from the federation platform, what is it that we can bring on board? And I think industry connect is something that we can bring on board. Mentors are something, you know, because we have enterprises who have grown over a period of time and today they are the big name in the industry. So that's where I think FTCC again 
can play a key role so one definitely besides angel investors and all those you know which you may find in any other i think mentorship is one industry connect is the second and um, i think also uh, we have our own ftcci pokerna skill center so that's also something that we are very very passionate about and we would uh, we we organize lot of mentorship programs and we would like to see many more startups come up in the future and if ftcci can play a small role in that we'll be very happy uh going forward what is the vision or what's your plan of action with ftcci you know it, it, both in the expo sector and also you know reaching out or outreach so um going forward i think uh, what also we've realized is it's very very important to calendar all the uh, annual flagship programs of the ftcci so that we have enough time for the industry connect to bring right partners on board uh we are planning an outbound trade delegation to brazil in the month of october in the month of january we would be taking a msme delegation to uh, turkey we also have lot of inbound trade delegation visiting us so that's again for the promotion of bilateral trade in terms of skilling we have lot of skill programs planned throughout the year and uh, soft skills export import management in fact i'm very happy to share that yesterday we got an approval from the ministry of commerce and industry uh for conducting five export import training programs in districts of telangana so that's what i think uh our our president or the whole management is very keen that we extend our services to district level so that's second we also have our uh, ftcci excellence award that's being planned and uh, that's an annual uh, award which is being given to 23 different categories and in fact i'm again happy to share that this year for the first time we uh, thought of have we always had 22 categories and this time we thought we will also uh, initiate or establish the 23rd category and sbi came forward because they've just come out with the sbi startup bank and they came forward to institute this so again we have 23 uh, different categories so that's the next plan and uh, we uh, in terms of this exhibition i think uh, we would make it as our annual exhibition so we we would wait till we get the feedback from our uh, members and then plan but it would definitely be on technology innovation for msme so whether it, whether it would be again sector specific or uh, general for the msmes will decide on that well all the very best for your forthcoming events and for the awards uh, something specially thank you very much <laughs> <laughs>